this is Calicut Beach, the most attracted tourist centers inside Calicut City. Here, if you're talking about Calicut Beach, you know that Calicut City is a coastal city, and we have like about 15 kilometers long coastal area in, uh, in this uh, beach. So here, the Calicut uh, Calicut Beach is one of the most crowded areas, as you can see over here. It's pretty pretty crowded over here, and uh, maybe in the evenings, people who are just sitting home idly, they just want to come over here and relax and then enjoy the wind. And right now, it's about to be sunset, so I think all of these people are eagerly waiting for the sunset. And uh, now, if you, uh, the Calicut city at this beach is actually the venue of all, when, whenever we have the Malabar Mahul Savam and everything, it is this beach that actually becomes our venues. So now, there are lots and lots to see over here, even water to relax and enjoy for a bit. So I will be going around, I will be enjoying the walk in the beach, the view of sunset and everything. And also, even though camels are something that you get to see only in deserts, here in Calicut city, the Calicut beach, we have camel rides. So I will be doing all that. You don't go away, be with me, because we will be taking a tour around Calicut beach. look up we have lots and lots of kites over here varieties of kites actually you usually what we see is all the diamond shaped kites but over here we even have the Doraemon we have lots of eagles we have sparrows we have owls and everything all such full of full-on variety kites over here we even have uh, in the Baipur we have the kites festival so there we have like thousands of kites on the, in the air all of a sudden but over here it's like each and every day we can see hundreds and hundreds of kites in this area. One of a good part of Calicut City, the beach, is that we have lots and lots to shop in this area. Not big shopping centers or like such things. But we have lot of those pitikadas where we have lot of upili tamanga, pineapple and all that. We have ice creams, cone ice creams, we have lots and lots of balloons and a lot of yeah, flutes. We can, I can see flutes, I can see ice cream stalls and of course peanuts. Don't forget peanuts because peanuts and beach is one of a great, great attraction. Now over here we can see lots of upili tamanga, nilika and everything. I think I should get one of these. What are upilita manga there? I've got one upilita manga. That's really good. Mm. I think I'll walk around the beach having this. Mm. That's pretty good. Now in the Calicut um, beach, nearby to Calicut beach, we have the Calicut Cooperation Office. We have the Calicut Beach Hospital. And it is very much next to the beach that we have the Valiangadi, the what say, the trading hub of um, Calicut city. And also we have the Kutichira and all the Juma Masjid and everything. It is very much close to the Calicut beach. Now this is exactly a very, very beautiful view that we have, we have just behind me. People are swimming, people are just enjoying the evening, they are just what's it splashing out at the beach and also the sun it was actually hiding behind the clouds so far it was like up above and then we spotted it right now till that it was behind some sort of cloud so we don't know whether we'll be able to see the sunset when the sun is um, drowning or what we say we're setting into the sea but let's hope we'll be able to see that till that let's watch the sun and enjoy the wind of the beach standing over here Okay, we took a complete round around the Calicut beach 
and I'm pretty exhausted right now. And I'm starting to feel sort of a little bit sleepy. So I think I should get a chai right now from here. I have a chai there, man. Now while I'm waiting for the chai, he's making chai for me. We can. We have actually lots of snacks over here. We have uh, Uldi Vada. We have Arikadka and all that. Calicut City. You have lots and lots of varieties in food actually. If you could like, um, there are numerous restaurants over here, and each of these restaurants has their own specifications. So if you are coming to, when you are coming to Calicut, don't worry about food because we have lots of restaurants and lots of varieties inside the city that would suit all your tasty needs. I hope my chai will be ready right now. So it was a tiring journey today. We started off today morning visiting the Tali Temple, seeking the blessings of God Almighty. Then we went around Calicut City. You know, speaking about Calicut City, it's always halwa that comes to our mind first. The sweet meat. We saw how we make halwa. We went to that particular spot, the Viva Halwa stores, and we explained to us in detail how halwa is made. Then again, we visited various other places inside Calicut City. We saw Mananjira. So, and finally, we came to the Calicut Beach. We enjoyed the beach. We played in water. We had a camel ride. I didn't like to watch that though. Still, it was a very joyful and eventful day. So we are winding up this episode. So please don't go anywhere because next week we will be back to you. Uh, taking you to more adventurous, more beautiful and such places, enjoying tourism as such and traveling to various places. So be with me even next week uh, at 7.30 in your favorite channel that's Rose Ball and me Nagma will be guiding you. So right now, let me have my chai and you can go and take your rest. Good night.